Hey everybody, Felix Stoffelbaker here. An older lady at my church who intercedes uh, received a word from the Lord and she actually read this out loud to the congregation. And it is a prayer prophecy and I just want to read it. I, I'm not making any of these claims. These aren't me. This was a lady who said that she got this from God. So I just want to share it, take it for what it is, and that's just how it is. You have to either believe that or not. This is from February 25th of 2023. I am your Father that healeth thee. Trust in me to do the work. I will show you what is coming in the near future. Don't be afraid. I will take care of the finances. Go forth rejoicing in what I am about to do. Miracles, signs, and wonders are going to be manifested. Great power in my name will be shown. You will see people so hungry that they will ask you, What can I do to be saved? I will give you the words to say. My prayer will be on you. My love is flowing through you so strongly. If my people who are called by my name will humble themselves and pray and seek my face, I will heal their land. Think East Palestine train derailment. My hand is not short and I will take what the enemy has done and reverse it. I will come against his forces. My angel army is ready for battle and it will happen soon. Be ready for things to happen in the spirit. I will show my power so mightily in the earth that it will tremble. The mountains will shake, the oceans will roar, the earth will rumble at the sound of my voice. My people will know it's my power destroying the enemy. Don't be afraid. I will take care of things concerning you. Watch my handiwork. It will be awesome. I will destroy what Satan has done to my people. The health organization is no longer going to be there. The FBI, the CIA, the government is corrupt and it will be taken apart. There are people there that are my people and I will use them to bring about the change. Hollywood is no longer going to be there. Their sin stinks in my nostrils. Their wickedness is destroying my children and I will take their kingdom down. The economy will crash but I will be there for you. I will show you what I need for you to do to help others. Have no worries, for tomorrow it will take care of itself. Show others my way in truth. I will take care of the fatherless and the children that have been hurt. Revival will break out all over. Be ready for the influx of souls. The harvest is great. Laborers is what is needed at this time. I will show my people what they need to be doing. Prayer is the key to unlock this. There is trouble coming to my church. Be ready for a battle to fight the enemy. I will be there to help in the battle. The pastor will be used mightily for this honor for what is coming. This hour for what is coming. Lift him up in prayer for the battle ahead. Shout for the victory. It will be glorious. My, la my hand is not short that I will be there to fight along with you. Pray for my strength to show how to fight this battle. Like Moses, he fought the battle and came out stronger and more powerful at the end. I will show my glory to all who come to my kingdom. Shout to the Lord in triumph. 
Shout to the Lord in praise, for the battle is won in victory, and the devil is defeated by our praise to God. My hand is moving through the church to see a great move. In the time, the church will have a place. I have put you in this particular place for a reason. I have a plan in place that goes beyond your reasoning. Trust me to be God. Mountains will move, valleys smothered, battles won. Go forth in victory, uh, rejoicing for what I have in store. And you can say whatever you want, but basically that was a letter of a lady who wrote down the word that God had given her during interceding prayer. And, you know, that is is what it is. So I just want to put that out there. You make of it what you will. I think that's extremely uh, powerful, and I believe every word of it. So that's one of the reasons why I wanted to share it. You know, all this looks like it's going... Uh, in a negative direction, but it's going in the direction uh, that God has planned, and everything will be taken care of if you're in that uh, will. So I just want to put that out there. Stoffel Baker out.